welcome to Crestwood, the School of Opportunities. We have such a diverse variety of extracurricular activities that you can participate in, but sometimes it may be a little overwhelming. Today we talked to some teachers that are in charge of these clubs and got a little more information to help you decide which ones you want to be a part of. Come on, let's go! Hi, I'm Miss Lem. I'm a guidance counselor at Crestwood and I run the Amigos program. The Amigos program pairs mainstream students with some of our wonderful LLS students and we meet at lunch on Thursdays in Mrs. Bird's LLS classroom. We do bracelet making, cookie decorating, button making. We have tons of fun at lunchtime. For Amigos, we have a few special activities where we often meet with other Amigos groups around the area for dances and barbecues, but the big event is when we go in the spring to Camp Kawartha and we get to do high ropes and low ropes, all the students, and we have a great day. Amigos runs every Thursday starting September 25th right through till the spring. Uh, at the end when we have our Camp Kawartha day, that's our last field trip and our last Thursday that we meet and if you want to get involved you can come any Thursday to B105 with Mrs. Bird's class or you can come down to guidance and sign up with me. Hey I'm Cray and I'm a member of the book club here in Crestwood called Fiction Addiction. In Fiction Addiction we meet every second Wednesday of the month and uh, we discuss books, uh, we talk to our friends, have lunch, and we also have dessert. Throughout the year, uh, we have two readers retreat where students come in, just hang out in the library, read books, watch movies, play games. And we also have a um, Mustang movie once every month where students come with their friends, hang out, and, and it's all free. We watch movies for free. I'm Paul Vanderbank, music teacher at uh, Crestwood, and I'm also responsible for the music ensembles here at the school. Currently at Crestwood, we have uh, several music ensembles that are performing. We have our wind ensemble and concert band, uh, jazz ensemble, drum line, and chamber choir. Uh, this year, like most, we have several uh, performances and events that we'll be participating in. Um, our drum line this year will be uh, very much involved with our own Pete's, um, as well as the Terry Fox run and uh, several football games, that type of thing. Um, all of our ensembles perform at various festivals, both locally and, uh, and abroad. Uh, this year we're actually looking at traveling to Quebec City as a, as a department. Unlike most uh, extracurricular, co-curricular activities, all of the music ensembles actually run all year, so we start in September and go right through to the end of May and into June. Hi, I'm Mary Scheller. I am the uh, sole, well, one of the sole art teachers here at Crestwood Secondary School. I look after the visual arts department, which is both visual art and craft. The art club gets together once every two weeks throughout the entire year, so usually after school for about two hours, and um, we work on different things, different media. Right now we have in progress, we started last year, a large four by six foot mosaic. Um, we also do day trips down to the Peterborough Gallery and uh, look at the, there's a couple other galleries downtown that we check out the art and, and kind of just have a little art field trip within the area as extracurricular. Hello, my name is Mrs. Bird. I'm a learning life skills teacher at Crestwood and I also coach cross country. We practice every day from 2.45 until 4 p.m. We do not meet on Fridays, however there's always a workout for students to do at home and that is posted on the bulletin board outside of the gym. 
With cross country, we get a chance to go to a few meets. Usually we go to about three or four. Uh, we go to some invitationals. Usually Ganaraska is the first invitational that we go to or at Trinity. And then there is Kawartha and a possibility of going on to CASA. So um, we've had some students go on in the past and we're really excited for the team this year. Okay, it's season for cross country. We start up right away in September when school begins and we usually go to about mid or the end of October. Those are just some of the many extracurricular activities that we offer here at Crestwood. We hope that this video has been informational and helps you figure out which ones you want to be a part of to help enhance your high school experience. Thanks for watching. I'm Nick Ballerin.